All right, folks, today I'm showing you a hack for your next chicken drumsticks. So stay tuned. It's time to grill. Two or three weeks ago, a nice video popped up on my social media pages. I can't remember exactly whose idea it was, I really have a lot of barbecue content popping up on my timelines everywhere. But this idea was so amazing I had to try this by myself. The guy took a chicken drumstick and opened it with three or four cuts just like I do here and he spread the meat like wings on the left and on the right side of the bone. And this is so easy I had to give this a shot and of course I have to show you all. The moment I saw this, a lot of thoughts came into my mind. First of all, I know a lot of people that are complaining about eating chicken wings or chicken legs due to the fact that they hate eating this with those tiny bones. This is really a game changer for eating meat right from the bone because you now have the possibility of one bite with a whole and good amount of meat in your mouth at once. This is a big thing for me. The second thing is that we speed up the cooking time now. Grilling drumsticks sometimes takes longer than expected. Coming back to the preparation. The rest is rather easy. We are using barbecue rub. I'm using a sweet and spicy barbecue rub today, but of course you can take your favorite barbecue rub for chicken. And we rub these from both sides. We are grilling those chicken legs on my Landman Kepler charcoal kettle today. This is why I have already prepared a starting chimney full of charcoal. We only need two spaces for today. We have a space for direct heat and a space for indirect heat. But we are grilling those flat chicken drumsticks more or less indirect today. Of course you can start with a little bit of high heat in the beginning on direct heat. But I prefer to grill them more or less indirect the whole time. Just place them on the indirect part of your grill, close the lid and let them sit there for about 10 to 15 minutes. Here is how they look after 10 or 15 minutes. I'm now letting them sit on the indirect part of the grill for another 5 to 8 minutes just with a short flip. Then I'm preparing my favorite barbecue sauce. We have a barbecue sauce with bacon flavor today, which is really, really a good one. And it has a nice and rich dark color. And then the rest is rather easy again. Just take off the lid. I'm a little bit messy with the ashes today. And then I am start glazing those chicken drumsticks with the barbecue sauce. I prefer glazing the skin side they now start to look crispy. And then glazing those chicken legs one or two times. If you ask me, the guy that invented that idea is a pure genius. You can now take this with your bare hands and you can have a whole bite of one of the best meat parts of the chicken just without touching the bone and for me this is a game changer and even for my kids they love the idea of those flat chicken drumsticks it's even good for those drumsticks that aren't meaty enough because you now have more beat more meat possible with one bite after glazing we are closing the lid again for another five minutes and then this is the result and of course, as always, we're going to take them off now. And we're plating them up. And then, of course, I'm going to give this a shot. I can't wait to hear what you think about that chicken hack. Looks beautiful. Please hit that like button and leave me a comment. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. We are seeing us again in the upcoming days. I have more videos to come, I promise. You could check out the video description for my fan pages. You can visit me on Facebook, on Insta, on TikTok. If you're grilling or re-grilling one of my video recipes, make sure to tag me. 
Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm out. See you.